All right, this is a brief video going over the setup process for the new Verifone M400 pen pad. So unlike the MX915 pen pad, this actually has two setup menus that we're gonna be working in today. So the first one we're gonna do, where we put in our network information, you're going to hit the pound six button. Sometimes you'll have to do it a couple times. You'll get to this screen here. The password is going to be 69900. Once we're in here, we want to go into network settings. You can just hit select or you can hit the green button on the keypad. Once we're in here, we're going to type in our IP address. This is going to be provided by the config guide uh, based on the MNSP you're using. For this example, we're just going to use the most common uh, with Verifone systems, which is going to be 192, touch the next box, 168, 031. And if this is the pen pad for register one, we're gonna make it 126. If it was register two, it'd be 127, and then 128, so on and so forth. Netmask is gonna be 255, 255, 255, and zero. Gateway, in this example, we'll use the 192, 168, 31, 31, which is the commander's gateway. We're gonna hit apply. Now in this screen, you can also go to your RFID support. Make sure that the RFID is enabled. Once we're done here, we're gonna hit exit. The pen pad is gonna reboot itself and then we'll move on to the next step. Okay, now that the pen pad is finished rebooting, we're gonna go into the second menu system, in which case we're going to hit the one, five, and nine buttons simultaneously. Okay, once in here, we're gonna hit enter or the green circle button to select supervisor and our password is going to be 1668321. Hit the green circle button again, do that. So first let's check out the date and time. We'll click on the administration option. We're gonna to go to the date and time. And in here, we wanna make sure we have the correct time set. You also wanna set a 24 hour reboot time. So I'm gonna click in here and we'll say we're gonna have this reboot at 2 a.m. So 02, enter, 00, enter, and 00 for seconds, enter. Penpad is now going to reboot itself again. We'll pop back into this menu as soon as it's done. Okay, now that it's rebooted, we're back into the secondary menu system. Let's go to admin again. And now let's go to our sound utilities. This is where we can increase the volume. Uh, out of the box, these things are pretty quiet, so you're gonna to wanna to change this volume. So on the top one, speaker volume, go ahead and increase that to max. And then go back, go back again. And let's go over how to inject it with debit encryption if you need to. So the first step you're gonna do obviously is request your debit injection from Verifone. Remember with the M400s, you're no longer selecting the MX option when you're looking for debit, you're going to select the engage option. From there, it's gonna be the same. You still use a serial number, select your encryption type, go through all the process. Once you download it, put it on a thumb drive, uh, you will insert it with the included cable into the dongle. Then you'll navigate to this menu and click update. Once you're in update, you can select on the USB memory option which I don't have a USB in here right now, but if there was, you would see your BMX file. You could download that and that would be it. Once you're done with all this, just go ahead and hit exit and reboot. Pen pad will now reboot when it comes back up. All you have to do is initialize it from the commander and you're ready to go.